Football always made me feel good, even when I was real young. As an openly gay footballer, I've never had any problems at any club I've ever been at. It's always been positive teammates, positive staff management fans. I've received abuse a couple of times from opposition. The most recent one, if it would have been a little one-off kind of thing, then I wouldn't have really been that bothered, but it carried on all game. Before I've even thought about it, I've had messages from chairman, manager, players, if you want to report it, we'll back you to the hill kind of thing. And he was he got reported by the club. I think attitudes are changing towards homophobic abuse, and the FA are trying to do more and more about it. Cleethorpes is a little seaside town on the east coast. It's a very friendly part of the country. What I love about running a local business is the fact that the community means a lot to me and I like the feeling at work, bring everybody as close together as I can. Cleethorpes Town as a football club is really, really well run. We was uh, obviously doing well in the league but was also still in the FA Vars. It culminated in us getting to the final and playing at Wembley, which is a dream for, for anyone, a dream for every footballer. Personally, to be the first openly gay player to play at Wembley, is, I guess it's a proud moment. I've never perceived myself as a role model, but then the reaction that you get from other people suggests that you are, and whether I like to think about it or not, I, I guess I am, even if it is in a smaller way than, than others. It shouldn't be a, a problem for any gay person to play football. They shouldn't have to feel like they can, and they shouldn't have to feel like that they're out of place. Football's for everybody. Anybody that wants to play the game, anybody that has a love for the game, it's there for them. Whether it be in a playing capacity, supporting capacity, watching capacity, it should be for everybody, and there shouldn't be anything to hold anybody back.